Hey you, what is going on everybody? Welcome, welcome back to the channel. And today I wanted to chill back a little bit and talk about some of the surprise entrants that I want to see at the Royal Rumble coming up later on this month. Now, I don't know about you guys, but the Royal Rumble is my favorite pay-per-view of the year. And yes, that does include even more than WrestleMania or any other pay-per-view that we get. The Royal Rumble is just a pay-per-view that I'm always looking forward to for many reasons. But all those reasons are due to one thing and that is obviously the Royal Rumble match. I love the match itself, the concept, the result of the winner going into WrestleMania, and the anticipation of who's gonna be the next entry all throughout the match is the best thing. It is that one time of the year where for a full hour I'm completely invested in what exactly is going on on TV. And even when it's predictable who's gonna be coming out victorious in that Royal Rumble match, the match always turned out to be great, especially because of the surprise entrance that there is. Whether whether it's a legend just making a one-off appearance or whether it's a past superstar making his return to the company, the Royal Rumble match always ends up being exciting to watch. So since the Royal Rumble is coming on Sunday January 29 at the end of this month, I wanted to quickly share with you guys uh, some of the superstars that I want to see as surprise entrance in this year's Royal Rumble match. Now I also want to hear from you guys who do you want to see as surprise entrance in the match. So let me know down in the comments below but nonetheless here Here's some of my surprise entrance wishes starting off with the demon himself Finn Balor. Finn Balor was unfortunately injured just after one month of making his Monday Night Raw debut and winning the Universal Championship. Unfortunately he had to relinquish the title due to his shoulder injury. Reports have been indicating and he stated himself that he wants to be back before Wrestlemania because he wants to be at Wrestlemania and honestly I hope that he is a surprise entrant in the Royal Rumble. It is highly unlikely but because because of that because it is so highly unlikely I think that the excitement that we will have if we do see him after basically not expecting him it's just gonna be off the roof making everything much more significant now if he is in it I want him to win it and I'm talking about regardless of who is a surprise entry or regardless of who is in the Royal Rumble if Finn Balor is in it I want him to win it and moving on to another man who has been teasing his return to the WWE for quite some time now and that is Kurt Angle recent reports indicate that Kurt Angle could be back with the WWE before WrestleMania. Now we don't necessarily know if this is true or not, but we do know that his indie bookings will be ending on March. So could we possibly see him for the Royal Rumble and then maybe after that we will see him later on for a WrestleMania match. This happened before for guys like the Dudley Boys, so this could definitely happen for Kurt Angle. If we do see Kurt Angle, I think this is gonna be one of those quote unquote AJ Styles moments for example. Just how we saw AJ Styles last year where we kind of figured that he was going to debut in the WWE but we didn't know and then we weren't unsure so Kurt Angle is one of those right now that are in that situation where obviously if we do see him make a surprise entrant at the Royal Rumble it's gonna explode. Another superstar I do want to see in the Royal Rumble and hopefully make his debut this year in the Royal Rumble is Samoa Joe 2016 might have been the AJ Styles year but Samoa Joe was ripping everything up in NXT. His heel work has has been the best in the WWE yes including obviously NXT and at this point it seems pretty obvious that he will be making his debut and I've been saying it for weeks now it looks like it is going to happen at the Royal Rumble after all we already know that he is not challenging for the NXT championship anymore and when this happened with NXT guys usually means that they are ready to move on to the main roster rumors or not I definitely see some more Joe making his main roster debut at the Royal Rumble now those are basically three of the top superstar that I do want to see make their surprise return at surprise entrance in the Royal Rumble match this year. Three other superstars that I do want to see back will be awesome if they were surprise entrants would be Matt Hardy and Jeff Hardy and Johnny Mundo. The reason why the Hardy boys weren't in my top three is basically because they are contracted to TNA right now and I know that they got a couple of more months so they will not be able to return at the Royal Rumble. Maybe for Wrestlemania but definitely not for Royal Rumble. Unless of course there's something we we don't know but nonetheless we all want them back it is just very difficult to see it happen at the moment considering their contract with TNA Johnny Mundo though might be very possible depending on his contract with Lucha Underground at the moment so we will definitely see what happens comes the Royal Rumble match itself so there you guys have it those are some of the surprise entrants that I do want to see on this year's Royal Rumble match let me know down in the comments below which legends or which past superstar you guys want to see come back maybe a Rey Mysterio maybe you agree 
agree with me with all my choices or like i said maybe you have actual ones just let me know i'm curious to see which ones you guys want to see in the meantime guys drop a like on this video so it can help the channel grow stay tuned for much more wwe 2k17 and wwe content so subscribe if you haven't yet savages because we're on the road to 10,000 subscribers much to see dig it